Scorpio, what up, though? Happy birthday. Happy Scorpio season. Happy Saturn Direct. Happy all of the transits right now, you guys. It is a very auspicious time for the whole collective, but my Scorpios, this is highlighting your energy right now. I'm hitting I'm hearing hidden epiphanies. Hidden epiphanies. This will be a general reading for the sign of Scorpio, wherever that resonates at for you. Keep in mind we all have an eighth of house. We all have Scorpio in our chart somewhere. You guys, energy is fluid, so take what resonates, leave the rest. You can flip the rolls if you need to. Um, don't try to make the story fit. Da 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 happy eclipse season. Scorpio, tapping into your energy. This reflection card came out first. Blow. Productivity. I hope this camera's focusing, you guys. It's been giving me a little bit of trouble, but it's still working nonetheless. Um, resilience, eruption, multiverse. Scorpio, you are merging timelines. You are switching timelines here. Um, a lot going on for you. Um, you being the warrior that you are, are rolling with these punches and getting to what's real. Um, and I feel like a lot happening for you right now. A lot going on. A lot going on externally, internally, behind the scenes, all that, right? A lot of lower frequencies. I feel like, Scorpio, you raised your vibration you raised your frequency you raised your level of consciousness and i feel like a lot of things that were not that are no longer resonating with your vibration are sort of falling away a lot of thought patterns a lot of situations a lot of relationships a lot of life tings right bubbling up to the surface um, and I feel like there are major realizations happening right now for my Scorpio Collective going through these transits. Like I said, a very auspicious time for the whole collective right now. So let's jump into this tarot and see what we have. Mother, Father, Divine, Holy Spirit of the Most High messages for my Scorpio gang for their highest good to help empower them to help bring them clarity what do my scorpios need to know what do they need to hear right now i'm gonna look at the past present and future <clears throat> thank you spirit currently a lot of things going on in the mental space right now you guys stress and and the mind going here and there wow as i look down we've got the ten of swords so spirit says take a deep breath take a deep breath the only thing that is real is right here and right now and you guys are making headway you guys are making progress here on your spiritual journey incoming for my scorpios wow Choo. So there's a lot of pain underlying this energy, you guys. But listen, there's a purpose for all of it. I've been saying a lot in the readings lately that nothing is happening to us. It is all happening for us. God keeps putting that on my spirit. Like, for the whole collective, everybody's going through this in their own way right now. Scorpio, but it looks like a lot of realizations happening like I said, a big vibrational shift for you. You are moving forward from a different energy, from a new and different mind state here. And I see you are working on yourself, Scorpio. You are working on you and your world right now. Um, trying to move toward what makes you happy. What makes you want to celebrate, right? <clears throat> I see a major success for my Scorpios. I see a big win. I see, really what I see is your angels surrounding you, Scorpio. And I see, it's like all eyes on me. Like, this is a super pivotal energy. And I feel like every choice that we make is going to be very important, right? And this is going to be about taking all that we have learned throughout these previous cycles, you guys. The hermit here, Virgo energy, 
the ninth card of the tarot. So this is representing a major ending, a major cycle ending, a major karmic cycle ending, right? And with the eighth card of the tarot here, back to back, two major arcana. And when we turn this eight sideways, we've got the infinity symbol, which is representing our destiny. It's representing our cycles, our karma, Saturn going direct, you guys. Um, a lot of karmic debts paid and over with and done with now. So anything coming up from the past, whether it's somebody hopping in your inbox, whether it's a situation, an old thought pattern, an old program that's still running in your reality, Scorpio, it's going to be important to notice these things, to cut them off, to move away from them. Spirit says that these contracts have been fulfilled, right, with this number nine here. And it's time to move toward what works. It's time to move toward what is going to bring happiness, joy, success, right? And this is about connecting with the souls and the people that are going to help you along the way, Scorpio. So trust the doors that are opening right now the relationships that are coming into your life and into your reality just as much as the doors that are closing and the relationships that uh the universe is telling you are finished and through right incoming all of this that you are learning is leveling you up scorpio in a big way we've got the world in your incoming energy representing the full circle of this cycle it's representing moving to a a new place a new energy this is totally got the the world is yours energy coming through with this person standing there with the world in their hands right and so some of my scorpios could be traveling or could be moving moving houses moving jobs um but ultimately all of my scorpios are moving into a new chapter we're moving into you know a new energy here <clears throat> and making the choice seven of cups to put the focus on ourselves here eight of pentacles taking classes taking workshops cleansing your energy learning about yourself um learning and mastering your craft this is really about putting the focus the energy and the work into yourself at this time and making the decision to do what's best for you Scorpio to move toward what makes you happy to move toward this happy home life this uh, whatever this is that's gonna bring this happiness in ten of cups is like the house with the white picket fence and the kids running around and the dog if that's something that you want what this really represents is your deepest desires right and and building this legacy and this solid foundation and this life that is you know produces happiness stability major major awakening here with the judgment card major you guys these are like all major arcanas right in the tarot there's major there's minor arcanas the major arcanas represent big energies along our journey major pivotal moments and situations <clears throat> and this is very big for you scorpio learning a lot and truly stepping into your power stepping into this beautiful new energy working through our shadow right having a conversation with the skeletons in our closet giving them love giving them the time of day instead of just pushing these parts of ourselves off to the side right they just want to be loved and accepted and i really feel like this is big for my scorpios right now again with that judgment this is like a spiritual awakening awakening to your power aligning with your truth here with the justice card libra energy you guys the karmic scales being balanced through these cycles right and again i'm seeing the full moon up there and it's like there's definitely this is representing a cycle fully illuminated right something's being fully illuminated here and balanced out with this justice card <clears throat> and with this judgment this is thoth 
right here and so you're connecting to your soul's wisdom right now scorpio you're connecting to your akash you're zooming uh honing in zooming in on these karmic cycles that have been replaying for lifetimes and lifetimes and it's sort of like you're waking up now it's almost like when you become lucid in a dream right you were dreaming the whole time but all of a sudden you you realize what's really happening here and uh this is beautiful energy really really putting this energy into yourself and gaining this soul level wisdom do grab some advice besides that eight of pentacles yeah you guys advice wow this is wild moving away from family and friends uh any type of thought patterns any type of people in your surroundings here that do not have your best interest so i feel like a lot of my scorpios are going through a lot of realizations and growth when it comes to relationships and like I said, be it with friends, family, um, associates, co-workers, um, I do feel as if there is situations being highlighted um, so that you can align. It's sort of like clearing away this energy so we can allow this new balanced healing energy, right? And so your advice being take, take this opportunity to align my Scorpio, stay positive, stay focused on the dream, stay focused on the vision, stay focused on this healing and this balance, right? And I do see you, again, the, another card of victory here and coming into this beautiful grounded Queen of Pentacles energy where you are receiving love, you are receiving abundance, you are receiving stability and... and um, the pentacles it's worldly things it's it's being grounded being stable being um concrete being in a sure situation so there's a message coming through not to focus too hard on these quote unquote spilled cups these failed relationships these situations that spirit is guiding you away from god got you here scorpio and you are being divinely guided through a portal here to like like we were saying an amazing new chapter and i keep seeing this portal everywhere you guys are literally right in the middle so probably seeing 11 11 1 1 1 things of that nature maybe even nines fives possibly as well um <clears throat> threes right this is completion um and harmony coming in so protect your energy right now from surrounding energies that want to knock you off your square or even internal i see you coming into a union and i see a big shift happening a big change again you truly are aligning with your destiny here scorpio so let's grab you an oracle card before we tap out if anyone wants to book a personal tap in with me my information is always down below in the description box I appreciate y'all stopping by. Make sure you hit that thumbs up if uh, this reading did anything for you, if it helped, if it resonated. Um, subscribe. Make sure when you do, you hit that bell, you guys, so you get the notifications on future readings and other content. What do we have for my Scorpios? Divine Mother. Damn. <clears throat> It's time to realize the true nature of certain life circumstances. Be grateful for what you have learned, but see things for what they are <clears throat> rather than what you wish them to be. You shall be able to recognize, process, and prosper from the truth, and you do not need to fear the revelations that are unfolding. And this is exactly what I meant by <clears throat> staring our skeletons in the face and sitting with them it is really looking into the situations in our life for what they really truly are on a deeper spiritual level everything has a double meaning everything has a deeper spiritual underlying message and meaning on a soul level my scorpios there is a lot of healing happening right now you guys <clears throat> <coughs> tantric queen 
my tantrics out there taking this and transmuting this pain transmuting this stress into strength into peace into happiness becoming a master of yourself a master of your mind a master of your destiny although you may be in uh, circumstances that you would prefer to not be in at this time you're actually in a position of unrealized spiritual power you will gain benefit from what is transpiring when the relevant learning and personal growth have been acknowledged and integrated these circumstances will give way to a more favorable situation <clears throat> this has been coming out for the collective a lot you guys you can trust what is happening now will give way to a new expression when the time is right. That time will be the best time. When your readiness matches the requirements for success, attend to your work with determination and hope in your heart. Trust that the divine is taking care of everything else. Your progress is spiritually protected. Yo, Scorpio, you're being initiated. <clears throat> You're being initiated into your truth. My, my throat chakra is... It's messing up right now, you guys. <clears throat> and you are moving through blockages that are blocking you from your truth. God is initiating you. You are chosen, right? And you are here to do exactly what you are doing. This is a beautiful awakening. Um, and I'm sending all y'all love take a deep breath with me right always remember too the devil is a lie you guys um so don't let anything throw you off your square throw you into a state of fear throw you into a state of anxiety or unrest right be still and know <clears throat> be still and know scorpio you you literally got this your progress is spiritually protected um yeah take a deep breath with me Hold it and release. You guys, when you take those deep breaths, picture your body filling up with white light. <clears throat> when you let it out, when you let your breath out, picture all of the lower vibrational stagnancy, disease, um, um, negativity, all of that. Picture it all leaving you, right? And then as you breathe, fill your body with white light. You guys stay rooted in your truth. Stay rooted in the here and now. Stay rooted in your light. And um, I hope to see y'all around.